I think it's fair to say that we take electricity a bit for granted. I know I do. I fast charge my phone, iPad, Mac, watch, and more every day without even a second thought. But the moment I'm away from the wall, or worse, when the wall doesn't provide power during an outage, I quickly realize how my situation immediately begins to crumble without an ability to recharge the devices I need most for work and life in general. Well, the obvious solution to this problem is, of course, battery power or power banks. I personally use several on a weekly basis to keep things charged and running smoothly even when I have easy access to a wall outlet. But the truth is, not all power banks are created equal, and I really didn't fully conceptualize this until Anchor sent over a few of their best power bank products for me to check out and integrate into my life in usage cases. So yeah, Anchor sent over a few of their products for me to try out, but the main one in question is their Solix C300 DC. This thing is unlike any other power bank I've ever tried. They actually refer to it as a portable power station, and for good reason too. For starters, it is a 300 watt total output, which is crazy powerful, enough to fast charge several devices all at once without any issue. This is also paired with an insane 90,000 milliamp hour or 288 watt hour capacity, which is about nine times what you're normally getting with an average power bank. The C300DC also has a very generous selection of seven ports, two USB-A, four USB-C, and a car socket, which definitely comes in handy. Another fun fact is that two of the USB-C ports here have 140 watt output and input, which is great for fast charging power hungry devices like my 16 inch MacBook Pro. But when it comes to charging the power station itself, you can actually take advantage of both 140 watt USB-C inputs and fast charge the C300DC at up to 280 watts, recharging the entire 90,000 million power capacity in just 90 minutes. This insane 280 watt charging can only last 18 minutes and reduces after this time frame to prevent overheating. Nonetheless though, this is the quickest way to recharge this gargantuan battery capacity, or is faster than using a single cable with 140 watts of input. But beyond the insane input, output, and capacity, however, there's actually one more port I forgot to mention. The Solix also has a solar input for charging with solar panels. This is great if you want to ensure that you can capture energy, regardless of if you have access to the power grid. Capabilities aside though, the Solix C300DC is also designed really nicely, with a clean, futuristic power cell sort of look to it, and a very solid build that can withstand impact. You can also buy a separate strap accessory to attach to make it easier to carry around. The C300DC also has a built-in light, which you can pull out sort of to create this lantern-style setup, which is super useful if you're using this outdoors or anywhere without lighting. You can also see cutouts on the sides of the unit for heat dissipation, which is paired with advanced internal temperature control to ensure long-lasting performance and reliability. The battery tech on the inside is also some of the best on the market right now. Compared to standard lithium-ion batteries, the lithium-iron phosphate batteries inside the C300DC offer superior longevity and safety as they're less likely to overheat when in use. All of this to say, there's a three-year warranty bundled in too, which doesn't hurt. Oh, and before I forget to mention, you can also connect the power bank or station to the Anchor app for more power information and a few other toggles. But how does it compare to other power banks on the market? Well, again, with its insane 90,000 milliamp hour capacity, the C300DC is really cost effective and negates the need to buy and carry around a bunch of smaller battery banks. And on top of being a great all-in-one solution, it again has built-in connectivity for solar charging. The C300DC also beats out some of Anchor's own products as well. It has 69% more battery capacity compared to their already impressive Prime Power Bank, and 30% more capacity compared to their 548 Power Bank that has a similar footprint. It also has three to four more built-in ports with 140 watt input and output again, unlike the 548. In terms of solar power, you can charge it up to 100 watts with the C300DC compared to 60 watts with the 548. And finally, the C300DC again boasts a crazy 300 watts of total output, while the 548 tops out at just 87 watts of total output. Speaking of output though, Anchor offers a C300 variant with built-in AC outlets. You get the same crazy 90,000 million power capacity, but with an even higher 600 watts of total output via AC for tools and other devices that use wall plugs. It's also a bit larger than the C300DC, but comparable in size to other power stations of its class and has an optional strap you can attach for portability. The built-in light is also smaller and there's one less USB-C port for charging, but otherwise it's really great if you need this type of power and throughput with the convenience of AC connectivity. But anyway, I'm sure you're thinking this is great and all, but how would somebody like me use devices like the C300DC? Well, I'm not much of an outdoorsman myself, but I definitely get to experience an aspect of living outside because the power goes out a few times a year here in Michigan, especially if you're a DTE customer. During an outage, I'd usually use a smaller battery with about 25% of the capacity of the C300DC, which was just enough to get me through the night or so, but not much more than that. 
Now though, now that I have the C300DC on hand, instead of stressing the next time the lights go out, I'll be way more at ease knowing that this giant battery is charged and ready to go during an outage, which can often last a few days in some cases. The built-in light is also great for this too, saving me from using my phone's flashlight to light up a room. The C300AC model is also fantastic for using your more typical household appliances or devices that need full-fledged AC power. Just for fun, I plugged in my desk setup, which features a power-hungry Pro Display XDR and laptop along with lamps and backlighting to see if I could use it all without plugging into the wall. And according to the power station's built-in gauge, I could power this whole ensemble for up to two hours straight, which is pretty crazy. The C300DC model is also great for long road trips with family and friends. I recently drove up north with my family and barely made a dent in the capacity while charging my phone the whole ride there. But if we all decide to plug in, the power station would be more than capable of providing fast charging to three plus iPhones and even a tablet or laptop without breaking a sweat. It was also nice to know that if we didn't have access to wall power for whatever reason while up there, we'd still have plenty to spare with this giant battery. That way we can always stay charged and connected to cellular for maps, calls, surfing the web, and more. And of course, the C300DC is great for outdoor usage as well if you're very clearly away from the wall. The built-in lantern style light offers a nice visibility feature at night and could serve as a sort of hub for charging at a campsite or a picnic table. Plus, if you're savvy and have a couple solar panels at your disposal, you can link the power station up to them directly and charge while the sun is out without a single worry about having to rely on your car or the power grid. I also find the C300DC to be a great source of backup power if I'm ever out shooting a video and need to charge a couple camera batteries, mic batteries, or whatever on the fly. But all in all, the Solix C300DC is a robust, powerful, cost-effective, all-in-one solution to so many of the charging problems you may face, and then some. Again, I'm happy to have one of these on hand when my power eventually goes out, hopefully not soon, or if I'm ever in a situation where I'm truly off the grid and need to charge up my many devices as soon as possible. The capacity and throughput are just crazy, and in the case of the AC variant, having this kind of power and connectivity is like having a wall outlet whenever and wherever you go. So definitely check out my links in the video description down below to learn more about the C300DC and C300. Also fun fact, during their pre-sale period, which lasts until August 27th, you also have a chance to win a free C300DC and a small rig photography kit. So again, links in the video description if you're interested in either of these products and to enter the contest. And that about wraps everything up. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks again to Anchor for sponsoring this video and supporting the channel. And thank you, of course, for watching. Expect more content from me coming soon. And as always, I'm Noah, and I will catch you all in the next one.